Hello, my friends. Hope you are doing well. Uh, today we will uh, discuss about the Cleanly, how we can embed uh, Cleanly within the Webflow and how it will work. Uh, basically, it's uh, it's the publish version. You can see here. Yes, when user click on any uh, date, he have an option to select the slot, uh, time slot. When user click on any slot, uh, after that we have this form and we will put uh, user uh, user uh, email address, name and uh, details and a schedule of the event. Uh, after uh, after scheduling, we will also get in uh, we will also get confirmation email. Uh, both of the both of the persons like me and the user both will receive confirmation uh, email. And also, you can say that it's such type of reminder. Okay, let's uh, move toward the Calendly. I will also provide its link in the description. Uh, yes. Uh, this is the event which I already uh, uh, set up and used uh, within the demo version which I showed you uh, in the last step. Uh, so how we can set up it? We have a, we have a button of this uh, create. When user click on it, we have a type of event we need to select. Uh, yes. Okay. We have different options. These are the paid services. And these are uh, free services when user click, like I selected for individual meetings. So I select the first one. This is the event name, like uh, we can say that Webflow training. Uh, it's Webflow training. And sorry, it's telling mistake. Location will be Zoom, Google Meet, anything you want. It's a description, it's uh, the event link. And we can select any color theme which we which we want to use. Okay, let me click on select the next. Okay, we we can use we have different custom settings. We can set them according to our need. Okay, next. Yes. Uh, now our form is select. We need to uh, on this. Ops, it's saying me to upgrade my account because in favor and it's only often one event, but no problem. We have already uh, set up one event and we can use that one. Mm, yes. This one is already uh, set up. Okay, uh, one thing more. Uh, I have a request, kindly subscribe my channel and uh, have a request to like my videos and share with your friends. Okay, when user click on this share button, we have different options to share with the link, to share with email, like you can share on the uh, WhatsApp groups or something else, and we need to embed in the website. Uh, in my scenario, I need to use it in inline embed. We have different options like like that getting started button. We, we can use in this format. Similarly, when user click on the button, we have some pop-up model. We can also use this service, uh, which is named pop text, but I need this service. I will click, select this and continue. Okay, after that, we can change our colors and thing, text color, button color, something which you want, you can do, no problem. After that, we just need to click on the copy code. I basically, I need this code, okay? It's copied in the Webflow. Uh, I need to use this HTML embed element. You can see here, yes, this is within the component. We have embed element. I already used it here and you can open it with this setting button and you can paste your code here. After that, you need to save and close. One thing uh, which should be in our mind, Custom code never uh, work within the Webflow. It should, uh, it should only work within the uh, on the publish side. For this, we need to publish the site from here. Publish to select domain, and I have testing domain. Just click, uh, just select this one, and I already published here. I hope you will like my work, uh, and have a request. Kindly appreciate my efforts. Thank you so much.